Okay, so now we'll be solving another example on limits. Okay, so we have this one. We need to find the limit of x squared minus 4 uh, and over x minus 2 as x approaches to 2. Okay, so we have here our solution. So have here another color. So first, we will try to solve this one uh, uh, by using our uh, by using algebraic man manipulation. So we have x approaches to 2 so this is x squared minus 4 over x minus 2 so we have limit of x as x approaches to 2 so this if we're going to get the factor of this one this would be x plus 2 and x Ah, no, x minus 2 okay so let's see we have x minus 2 so cancel so we have limit x as x approaches to 2 so we have x plus 2 so we just substitute 2 here so it will be 2 plus 2 and we have 4 so we are going to use the L hospitals rule Okay, so let's try if we could apply our L hospital rule here. So we have f of x is equal to x squared plus, uh, no, minus 4. So our f prime of x is equal to 2x. Then g of x is equal to x minus 2. So our g prime of x is equal to... 1 so if we are going to sub to have now our equivalent in hospital rule so we have limit so f prime of x over g prime of x our f prime of x is 2x over 1 as x approaches to 2 so we have we are going to substitute we have 2 times 2 over 1 and that will be equal to so we will have the same answer okay so we will ha have again another example so we have this one so limit of 2x minus 1 over x plus 2 as x approaches to infinity okay so we have here the our limit now is uh, approaching infinity so for this one, we could go, um, we could use one of our special limits here. So we just first solve this one using um, using algebra, our algebraic manipulation. So we have solution. Okay, so we have, just copy first the given, 2x minus 1 over x plus as x approaches to infinity so let's um, maybe let's divide both sides of the equation by um, multiply both sides of the equation by 1 over x so x minus 1 so times 1 over x over x plus 2 times 1 over x okay so in this in this uh in this way we are not altering the uh the given equation because if you are going to divide this one it is be equal to 1 so we we are not doing something that is illegal to to algebra okay so we're just doing this in order for us to have a uh, a special um, identity okay so we have limit x approaches to infinity so this will become now 2x over x minus 1 over x over x over x plus 2 over x okay then we will have will have limit 
x infinity so we have 2 minus 1 over x over this will be 1 plus we should we could factor out here the 2 so 2 over 1 over x okay so let's just uh, let's substitute our given here the infinity the limit to our given function so we could have that one as 2 minus 1 over infinity over 1 plus 2 times 1 over infinity okay so let's first analyze uh, analyze what is 1 over infinity okay so if we have 1 over for example we will have um let's just use another pen here so that we could uh, have much clearer okay one over infinity okay infinity is a large number so if you are going to have one over one thousand so this will be equivalent to sub our calculator maybe our virtual calculator we we'll use that one is so a one divide divide one thousand okay so that is equal to uh, that is 0 0.001 we could have the one function so we have 0 0.001 if you if you will have 1 over 10,000 so it will be equivalent to 0. Point, so 1 2 3 4 0, 0, 0, 1. so as you notice as your number gets larger your quotient at, Oh, your, your quotient approaches to zero so for example we have one over your cal, your cal, cal, the maximum number that your calculator could have is one times 10 to the power of 99 or times 10 to the power of 99 so let's see what will be the calculate the answer of the calculator okay so we have here okay so let's just have one divide 1 raised to the power of 99 and the answer is you have here 1 so that is 0 followed by uh, that is um, 0 0.98 zeros okay so 0 0.0000 that, that we have 98 before we could get to 1 so it is so we just have that one as 98 98 before we could go to one so with this one we could say that if our divisor is a large number for example infinity we could have conclude we could say that our quotient will be equal to zero okay so for example we will uh, we will increase our we will increase our divisor for example we will have 50 to the power of 99 you see this this is now a much larger number compared to 1 to the power of 99 so that is now not error because uh, that is the we have um, gone to the limit of the calculator for example 2 to the power of 2 times 10 to the power of 99 so 0 Okay, so let's just first have a side track here. What is the maximum that our calculator could have? Okay, so maybe two, I believe two. Or about five. Let's just use five. Five, so five. So six. So we're now looking for the maximum number our calculator could have. Okay, so maybe it is 8 so have it. because 10 could not do for 10 okay so it's 10 so 9 between 9 and 10 maybe okay 9 so but nonetheless 1 over infinity is equal to 0 so here we could say so let's just have it 1 green we could say that 2 minus this is 1 over infinity 0 over 1 plus 2 times 0 and our answer now is equal to 2 
Okay. So that is the algebraic way of solving this problem. Now we will try to have this one using um, L Hospital's rule. Okay. Maybe let's just have a new page here. Okay, so the given is okay. So we have limit limit of okay. So that's one limit of. 2x minus 1 over x plus 2 as x approaches to infinity. So we'll just first get our f of x. We have that one yellow. So our f of x is equal to 2x minus 1. So our f prime of x is equal to 2. Our g of x is equal to x. So our g prime of x is equal to 1. So this will now be equivalent to limit x as x approaches to 0. So we have f prime of x. So that will be 2 over g prime of x. That will be 1. So our answer is uh, if we are going to substitute x. So there is no x here. So our answer will be Two. And this is now the limit of this function. So that is so much, uh, it is much easier if you are going to use the L hospitals rule. Okay, next. Maybe we will just have the next problem on the next video. So I, think, I hope you learned something from this video. And as always, keep on studying.